Nikki Glazier's roast of Tom Brady, a delicate balance of comedy and boundaries. Comedian Nikki Glazer recently shed light on her decision not to make jokes about Tom Brady's son, Jack, during the roast of the football legend. Glazer revealed on The Howard Stern Show that she had initially planned to joke about Brady kissing Jack on the lips in his 2018 documentary. However, she explained that the collective decision was made not to involve Brady's children too much in the roast, as they did not ask for that kind of attention. Glazer also shared her perspective that the kiss between Brady and Jack was a cute moment that had been taken too seriously. In this article, we explore Glazer's stance on the matter, the reactions it sparked, and the overall balance between comedy and respecting boundaries. Nikki Glazer's decision not to make jokes about Tom Brady's son, Jack, during the roast was a conscious choice made by the collective team involved in the event. Recognizing that Brady's children did not choose to be in the public eye, they aimed to respect their privacy and well-being. This decision highlights the importance of considering the impact of comedic material, especially when it involves personal matters and the lives of individuals who did not actively seek attention. Glazer mentioned that she had planned to joke about Brady kissing Jack on the lips in his documentary. However, she expressed her belief that the moment was taken too seriously considering it to be a sweet and innocent gesture between a father and his child. This perspective opens up a broader discussion about societal norms, personal boundaries, and the interpretation of family dynamics. While Glazier's opinion may differ from others, her intention to avoid potentially harmful jokes aimed at a child speaks to the responsibility and sensitivity required in comedy. During the roast, Nikki Glazer did make a joke about Tom Brady and Bridget Moynihan's breakup before they found out she was pregnant with Jack. While Moynihan has not directly responded to the joke, she shared a cryptic Instagram quote about loyalty. This response suggests that the joke may have stirred up emotions or sparked a reaction in Moynihan. It serves as a reminder that even though comedy is intended to entertain, it can have consequences and affect individuals involved indirectly. Another topic touched upon during the roast was Tom Brady's divorce from Giselle Bunchen, which reportedly disappointed her. While the details surrounding their divorce remain private, the mention of this sensitive subject can be seen as crossing a line, as it delves into personal and potentially painful matters. This highlights the delicate balance comedians must maintain between pushing boundaries for comedic effect and respecting the privacy and emotions of those involved. Nikki Glazier's decision not to make jokes about Tom Brady's children highlights the importance of setting boundaries in comedy. While comedy often pushes the envelope and challenges societal norms, it is crucial to consider the potential impact on individuals who did not actively choose to be part of the comedic narrative. Glazier's approach serves as a reminder that comedy can be both entertaining and responsible, striking a balance that respects personal boundaries and emotional well-being. This incident surrounding Nikki Glazier's roast of Tom Brady generates conversations about the role of comedy in society. It prompts discussions about the line between humor and insensitivity, the responsibility of comedians to consider their material's potential impact, and the importance of respecting individuals' privacy. By sparking these conversations, comedy has the power to shape societal perspectives and encourage thoughtful dialogue. Nikki Glazier's decision not to make jokes about Tom Brady's son, Jack, during the roast of the football legend highlights the importance of setting boundaries in comedy. By recognizing that Brady's children did not choose to be in the public eye, Glazier and the collective team aim to respect their privacy and well-being. This incident prompts discussions about the role of comedy in society, the delicate balance between humor and sensitivity, and the responsibility of comedians to consider the potential impact of their material. Ultimately, it serves as a reminder that comedy can be both entertaining and responsible, fostering conversations and shaping societal perspectives.